Hello, my name is Skip Reynolds, the host of Hobo Hunters, the show where the only thing more deplorable than the prizes are the contestants. Now let's meet them. Contestant hailing from Podunk Town, USA, Pastor Simon Williams. <laughs> Praise God. And after digging into the confessions and the donations and crashing my vehicle into the church front doors, I realized I, I needed to uh, do some soul searching. That's why I've been sober for the past six months. That's why I'm on this show here today. Our second contestant, Danielle Storms. I prefer Insa now. So I just want to say hi to all my YouTube followers. I know you guys are watching and learning to do the right thing through me. I'm so glad to be your teacher. And I also want to say, fuck you, dad, and that nasty cunt, Jen, who stole my dad away and taught him these Christian values. And our third contestant, Irvine Maplebottom. Hello all my children, waiting for the new horizon. As my children know, I was chosen by the Great One above to bring humanity to the next enlightenment. And I know the Great One has told me that there is treasure and gold and the new manna from the heavens lies within the hobos. The rules of hobo hunters are simple. If you injure the hobo, you win a sweet prize. If you manage to kill him, you get an all expense paid trip to visit Marshall Applewhite on the Millenarian. Now let's meet our hobo for the day, Mr. Danny Wallace. Nah, bro, it's a little whitefish. Danny Wallace. Little whitefish, bro. Danny Wallace. Fuck out of here, man. What you doing, bro? Slap me. Fuck's wrong with you, boy? Fuck off, man. I'm the best rapper in the world. Y'all can't treat me like this. Ah, shit, bro. Damn. Damn, all these The contestants are supposed to do the kickoff. What? Damn it, Adam. Why the fuck does he still have a job? Kevin Spacey's nephew. You guys are ruining my life. Here we go now. Fuck. I can't get this motherfucker off, man. Hey, yo, cameraman. Can I say hi to my moms real quick? What's up, baby? Alright, so basically my name's Lil Whitefish and shit, you know what I mean? I mean, my government name is Danny Wallace. But fuck that name. My mom's gave me that name. That, 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 she ain't got no booty. She ain't no real woman. Lil Whitefish only gets with the bitches with the big ass monkeys on the back, you know what I'm talking about? Ride that shit real good, you know what I mean? All the way to the Grammys, bitch. That's where I'm going. Anyway. I'm on here voluntarily, you know what I'm saying? I volunteered to do this shit so I could promote my hot-ass mixtape, Big Pond. Because basically the rap game is a big pond, and this little white fish gonna take that shit over. So I'm gonna make your moms bend over, and I'm gonna tap that shit from the back with my nut sack. Yeah, that's right. Hey, yo, little white fish, I got mad bitches. I kill all this... <laughs> oh, shit. Hold up. Well, shit, I mean, ain't nobody around. Might have to take my meat out real quick. God, when I get out of here, bro, I'm gonna fuck somebody up, man. I'm gonna take that yomper out. Damn, man. Fuck. Oh. Yo. Hello, my hobo child. Who the fuck are you, bruh? Come. 
drink some manna with me. I have some lit beats that we could listen to. Perhaps you could lay down some of your dope tracks. Oh, word. Come. They lit though? Oh, I'm come, my child. That shit up. Children of the New Horizon, I, your leader, have come to Hobo Hunters, and I have found our first martyr that will take our movement to its next level, and eventually the movement of humanity to its next existence. I have found a hobo child, and I have cultivated him, and I will use his ignorant hip-hop mentality against him, and then receive the manna that is in him, the hobo manna. So, camera guy, have you uh, heard about the teachings of our Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam? Um, ISIS comes with its own rewards, you know, but, but the real reward is what you get out of the teachings. I mean, the things that I have learned about Allah and the afterlife and all of the rewards that I will be getting, it's just, it's not something I could pass up on. Well, have something a sweetheart. I was, now, I couldn't help but overhear you speaking to this gentleman here with your forked ton lies uh, about your your religion and I just have to say now now hear me out um it if I could if I could trouble you for just a moment I truly believe that uh, you as um a white Caucasian female uh, would would be more well suited in the teachings of the Lord and now if you just accept Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior all will be forgiven First of all, don't call me sweetheart, okay? <laughs> uh, excuse me, but I, Is that funny? Uh, well, I, I, I was under the impression that uh, Muslim women were a little bit more subservient to the male counterparts. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You know what else is funny? This bomb strapped to my chest. Because if I blew you up right now, the rewards I would get from Allah would be phenomenal. Would you like to see him? Um, uh, you, you know, I, I think that, um... We could we, arrange that. You know, we, I think this has been quite a, a very revealing conversation. Uh, I'll see you um, if we have Sunday Mass uh, every, every 6 o'clock in the morning. Maybe I'll see you there, but <laughs> not today. If you change your mind, let me know. So the way that Simon spoke to me out in the woods is really, it really reminds me of why I joined ISIS. Because it's not only what's wrong with Christianity, but what's wrong with America in general. Robo Hunters will be right back. What is this shit? That fucking camera on my face. Fucking pussy. Has your daughter, son, or other arbitrary loved one recently been recruited by the cult masquerading as the Church of the New Horizon? Well, I'm Gary Pecker of Pecker, Pecker and Associates. Call us as we are representing a class action lawsuit against Irving Maplebottom and his church. Call us now and help get you your piece of my anus. Oh, great one. Thank you for this hobo manna. Thank you. He has your eyes. Near, far, wherever oh, you are. Bro, that song fucking sucks. So what you doing with my spleen, bro? Give me back my spleen, dog. My child. <laughs> You need to relax. Shut the fuck up and give me back my spleen, bro! You need bro. to relax. Let me I, speak your man, language. fuck you! You need to chill. Yeah, you don't know my language, You need bro. to chill. I'm the white man! You're going to come to the new horizon with us. Be very quiet. I'm hunting infidels. I'm gonna pop your ass, bro! I'm gonna pop your ass! I got that man kid in my mother control, bro! I'm gonna pop your ass! Everything, bro! Give me back my spleen! Give me back my mother spleen! I do need a spleen, bro! I need a spleen to be the best rapper in the world! I'm the best rapper in the entire world. Give me my spleen! My motherfucking spleen! Oh, shit. Ah, ah, ah.
The white fish. White fish. White fish. White fish. Ah, damn. Oh my God. Have you recently noticed a gradually increasing distance between you and a son or daughter or various and sundry loved one? Do you suspect this might be due to a lack of mana within? I'm Gary Pecker of the Church of the New Horizon, urging you to call us now at Becker, Pecker, New Horizon Associates, now. Hmm, now I choose not to make any decisions without first consulting the Lord on how to proceed. So that means if I don't hear from him about brushing my teeth, Put it on pants, not having to pay child support payments. I, I won't do that. Brenda, those children are far too corrupt for me in my life with the Lord. So you can have them. But of course, you're still invited to the barbecue next Sunday. Goddamn pot leaf. Fra fr fr free free weed, son! Oh shit, let's get some puff puff give this motherfucker boy! Hey yo, where the weed at though? Here it goes! <laughs> Ooh, I'm about to go old testament on this ass. <laughs> Ooh, this smooth. Tan ass. Turn that damn camera off! I see it. Turn that damn camera off, you motherfucker! And they said I could I couldn't do anything with myself. Well look now, god damn it. What kind of drop in me was needed. That Muslim bitch didn't think she could do it. No, no, no. It was good old Simon Williams. Really just I feel like celebrating, you know, it's it's a cause for celebration. Another hobo is dead and off the streets and all is right with the world again in our little town here anyway. So just, could, could use maybe a sip. <laughs> just, just something to, to, to you know, uh, cleanse my palate a bit of all this salvation and this, and this deliverance of the Lord. Does anybody have, have like a, uh, like a, a, a little finger of whiskey or something, maybe a little bit of schnapps or vodka? I know some of them kids be putting tampons up their butts and soaking them with vodka. I, I, I'm open to all sorts of methods. <laughs> and we have our new Hobo Hunters champion, Simon Williams. Turn it off. Shh, shh. Mr. Reynolds, please. Do you hear that? Can you feel God's love and warmth inside you? I can feel it in me, sir. I can feel huh. the both of us. Huh. He has blessed I, us today. Uh, oh. Fuck you! Oh! Oh! Shit. Oh! Oh! Fucking hobo! Oh. What the fuck oh, is wrong you with you? you bitch. Bitch. What are you doing? Oh. You're ruining my life! Oh, oh you what the fuck is this? This is not a fucking show! Oh. God damn it, Adam! Oh, Why hasn't he been fucking fired yet? It's not on you, Nick. This is the third fucking person he's killed. What the fuck is going on? Get this shit out of here. What the fuck? This is my fucking life and you're fucking up. God damn it, cut these fucking cameras. Cut these fucking cameras.